Ah, so, okay, so the, the moral question. So cars are going to have to make moral choices because uh, if you're presented with crashing into uh, a car or a tree or an old person or a young person, all these sort of horrendous sort of, uh, um, sort of choices that we make. So humans make these choices uh, using sort of gut feeling, gut instinct, but we all make the choices as we go about our lives. Cars uh, are going to have to have them explicitly defined. So they're going to have to look and, and certain people are going to have to sit down and write explicit moral rules for cars that say you should do this if presented with a, an unacceptable choice you're going to have to make the choice and, and, and take the least unacceptable path. Probably around about 90% of accidents are human caused, so I would um, prefer actually to trust a, a machine which has, has a um, lower accident rates because in the end it has to do with my safety but also the safety of uh, everyone around. In the automotive industry there's a concept of functional safety so a car will always be, uh, must, must always be able to, to be safe by itself. Um, and to uh, bring it always in a safe mode. Um, but by having cars connected, we can collect a lot of data, we can improve algorithms for automated driving and uh, take even better decisions by, by over time, by learning about how, how automated driving cars are behaving in, in uh, particular situations. And I think by doing this, we can, we can have even more or even better decisions every day. Computers are able to react far, 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 far faster than a human being can. Like, a hundred times faster. The moral decision making is the biggest challenge in the autonomous vehicle. The idea that is the car going to choose to kill the occupant versus five pedestrians or you know the, I mean there's endless numbers of permutations of that that moral question. Um, is it going to make a different decision if I have my three-year-old in the back? And is it really right to leave that moral decision to a computer? I mean, that is probably the biggest problem uh, that the industry faces. And I, I, I don't have an answer for you, but I, yeah, I mean, it, it's definitely a serious concern.